Okay, I'm already up. Okay, boss. Well, we're just loading all the empties away from last night's show and uh, the night before, uh, and reach premising ready for tonight, uh, right through the Sunday. So it's a lorry load here. It looks good, doesn't it? Normally start at quarter to seven. If they call me out, it could be four o'clock in the morning. If we've got a, a problem, there's always a, a teething problem on something. If somebody's got a problem on a boiler or something like that, you could come out and you fix it straight away. I mean, I've been driving machines since I was like six, seven years old on the farm here. You've got to keep your hand and your eye in on a machine, you know, you've got to be used to driving it. It's a knack with everything, you know. But everything's got modern, but uh, we've kept with the times, you know. Did you know the 32 blew its uh, tap off? No. Yeah, well, I sent Len down. We were so busy oh, up there. Well, I well, said well, a problem on the mobile home site. Uh, one of the boilers just blown up with a weller, flooded the van. It's an empty one. So we've got there's another carpet and all that in, but that's just one of those things that happens, you know. If I come in, I, I would cook my own, yeah. I'd go in there and I wouldn't let the chef do it, I'd do it myself. Slowly, but well done. I reckon to open it perhaps late this summer. When we're working and we've got, with our maintenance crews and thing, when we've got days where they haven't got anything, so there's always dead times. And there's always times when you can't, you haven't got enough men. When we've got that open, then we're going to look at it and then go and finish and put the golf, a nine hole golf course around. I think you, the more sleep you have, the tighter you are. Uh, uh, if I have four and a half hours, I'm okay. If I was slept for eight hours, I would be tired. I'm, uh, I'm not going to retire, ever. I mean, uh, my dad never retired. I mean, wh why do you want to retire? The most interesting thing in life is working. Hiya, right? Bob. Been a busy day today. Right. Have you had any tickets handed back? Any? No, we haven't. Nothing In fact, we've had hundreds of phone right. calls. So we've got no seats left? No, nope. fully sold no. out. Any other problems? No, but I'll give you a ring on your mobile should anything happen. OK, then. Thank All right. you. Okay. Have a pleasure. When I come to the building, it just does the same as when I first opened it, because it's, it's special to me. I'm going straight to the door now. And I will stay there now for the next uh, hour, uh, three quarters of an hour to an hour. Something about the atmosphere and the, what's happening in here, it's not just the dance, it's the people, the warmth, you know. Uh, it's special. This place is special for dance. <laughs> Here we are, Barbara, 1978, the fire. We're writing the book and uh, we go back over uh, the uh, past uh, history. Uh, I thought 
God, that's good. I, I didn't realise at the time I missed all that because you're moving so fast you miss a lot in life because when you've done it, you're moving on. You don't realise, well, that's good. I think that's, uh, that's the exciting part of it, really. OK, that it? Well, if you like, yeah. OK. okay. Right, I think I'll go to bed now, then. Well, I've got a few more things to do. OK. If you're interested in what you're doing in life and you like your job, then uh, that's what it's about. I mean, sleeping, when you go to bed at night, if you're sleeping eight hours, you're wasting a lot of your life. I mean, I'm I've, I've not wasting any of mine. I'm living every minute of it. You're too long dead, aren't you?